I love this song in Jesus' name. I love um, that, you know, Israel and I were just talking a lot about, you know, worship songs and, you know, how do we write these songs for the church going forward that would give us a, such a great declaration of our faith. And, you know, my life, like many of your lives, has been hit by cancer of people in our immediate family that have lost their lives. And I'm like, God, you said greater things we would do in Jesus' name. and. Um, you know, so I've been just studying that and looking at that and Israel and I are talking about that and we're like, okay, so let's write a bold declaration that will really help people such as us declare the name of Jesus over every situation. That's where in Jesus' name has come from. And so again, you get to the chorus, it says, and I will live and not die. You know, if, if we're gonna believe it, hey, then we better it's good to sing it. I will live and not die, the resurrection power of Christ alive in me. And I am free in Jesus' name. And, and when we get to the bridge, you know, it's pretty exciting because you, again, you see people getting fired up in their spirit. God is fighting for us, pushing back the darkness, lighting up the kingdom that cannot be shaken. In the name of Jesus, the enemy's defeated and we will shout it out, shout it out. That's in Jesus' name. You know, don't allow the enemy to keep you small and push you back and dictate to you the terms and conditions of your life. You know, I encourage you to get back into the Word and get, I don't know, fine-tuned what the Bible says that is the authority that we have in Christ. And let's use it, let's sing it, let's stand in it, let's live um, in this way. And, you know, who knows what's going to happen, but I do know that that the time is urgent. There is a um, whole lot of people on the earth that, that need victory in Jesus' name. Sing it well, sing it with authority, amen.